The global political arena has been fraught with tensions that recall the chilling specter of the Cold War, with Russia at the forefront of these escalations. Russian President Vladimir Putin's recent warnings of a potential World War III have sent ripples of concern throughout the international community. This rhetoric, coupled with Russia's aggressive military maneuvers, has led analysts to speculate on the possible repercussions for Russia itself. President Vladimir Putin's statements have often carried a tone of assertive nationalism, but his recent warnings of World War III have raised the stakes considerably. These threats are not merely rhetorical, but reflect Russia's broader geopolitical strategy. Putin's rhetoric serves multiple purposes. It aims to rally domestic support, deter Western intervention, and assert Russia's influence on the global stage. However, this aggressive stance could backfire, potentially isolating Russia further and leading to severe economic and military consequences. Internally, Putin's warnings of a looming global conflict serve as a tool to consolidate power and maintain his grip on the Russian populace. By presenting Russia as a nation under threat from Western aggression, Putin fosters a sense of national unity and resilience. This narrative is particularly effective in rallying patriotic sentiments and diverting attention from domestic issues such as economic stagnation, corruption, and political repression. The portrayal of an external enemy is a time-tested strategy for autocratic leaders to strengthen their hold on power and justify restrictive measures. On the international stage, Putin's rhetoric aims to deter Western intervention in regions of strategic interest to Russia, such as Ukraine, Syria, and the Arctic. By raising the specter of World War III, Putin sends a clear signal that any significant military action against Russian interests could escalate into a catastrophic global conflict. This threat is designed to create hesitation and strategic calculations within NATO and Western governments making them more cautious about engaging in direct military confrontations with Russia. Putin's warnings also serve to assert Russia's influence and reassert its status as a major global power. The rhetoric of impending global conflict underscores Russia's willingness to defend its interests aggressively and its capacity to disrupt global stability if necessary. This strategy aims to position Russia as an indispensable player in international affairs compelling other nations to negotiate and cooperate with Moscow on key geopolitical issues. Despite these strategic objectives, Putin's aggressive stance carries significant risks. Heightened tensions and the threat of global conflict could further isolate Russia diplomatically and economically. Western nations may respond with increased economic sanctions, targeting critical sectors such as energy, finance and technology, exacerbating Russia's economic challenges. Additionally, Military overextension and the strain of maintaining a confrontational posture could weaken Russia's military capabilities over time, leaving it vulnerable to both external and internal pressures. On the domestic front, Putin's warnings are likely designed to bolster nationalistic fervor and consolidate his grip on power. By portraying Russia as a fortress besieged by hostile Western forces, Putin can justify repressive measures and the centralization of power. However, this strategy carries significant risks. Economic sanctions imposed by Western nations in response to Russian aggression have already taken a toll on the Russian economy, leading to inflation, currency devaluation, and a decline in living standards. Prolonged economic hardship could eventually erode domestic support for Putin's regime, leading to political instability. Internationally, Putin's threats could further isolate Russia. Relations with Western nations, already strained, could deteriorate to a point where diplomatic engagement becomes virtually impossible. The international community might respond with heightened economic sanctions, diplomatic ostracism, and increased military support for Russia's adversaries. Such measures would further cripple the Russian economy, hinder technological advancements, and weaken Russia's global standing. One of the most immediate threats to Russia is economic collapse. Sanctions have already restricted access to international financial markets, technology, and investment. An escalation in military aggression could trigger a new wave of sanctions, targeting critical sectors such as energy, banking, and technology. Given Russia's heavy reliance on oil and gas exports, further restrictions could severely damage its economy. The depletion of foreign reserves and the collapse of the ruble could lead to hyperinflation, unemployment, and widespread poverty. Russia's military strategy 
involves maintaining a significant presence in various conflict zones, including Ukraine, Syria, and Libya. While this demonstrates Russia's ability to project power, it also strains its military resources. An escalation of conflicts could lead to military overextension, where Russia's armed forces are spread too thin to effectively manage multiple fronts. This would not only weaken Russia's military capabilities, but also expose vulnerabilities that adversaries could exploit. Economic hardship and prolonged military engagements could lead to domestic unrest. The Russian populace, facing declining living standards and conscription pressures, might lose faith in Putin's leadership. This could manifest in widespread protests, civil disobedience, and even rebellion. The Russian government's response to such unrest would likely be heavy-handed, leading to further domestic strife and international condemnation. To understand Russia's current military strategy, it is essential to consider its historical context. Post-Soviet Russia, under Putin's leadership, has sought to reclaim its status as a global superpower. This ambition has driven Russia's military strategy, which emphasizes modernization, strategic deterrence, and regional dominance. Russia has invested heavily in modernizing its military. This includes developing advanced weaponry, enhancing cyber capabilities, and improving logistical support. The modernization efforts aim to create a more agile, responsive, and technologically advanced military. This is evident in Russia's development of hypersonic missiles, advanced air defense systems, and electronic warfare capabilities. These advancements are designed to counter NATO's technological edge and enhance Russia's strategic deterrence. Strategic deterrence is a cornerstone of Russian military strategy. This involves maintaining a robust nuclear arsenal, capable of surviving a first strike and retaliating with devastating force. Russia's nuclear strategy is based on the concept of escalate to de-escalate, where the threat of limited nuclear use is intended to deter conventional conflicts. This strategy is designed to create uncertainty in the minds of potential adversaries, thereby preventing escalation and preserving Russia's strategic interests. Russia's military interventions in Ukraine, Syria, and other regions demonstrate its commitment to maintaining regional dominance. These interventions serve multiple purposes. They protect Russian interests, project power, and challenge Western influence. The annexation of Crimea and the support for separatist movements in eastern Ukraine are examples of Russia's efforts to secure its geopolitical interests. In Syria, Russia's military presence has helped sustain the Assad regime, counterbalance Western influence, and secure a foothold in the Middle East. Despite its strengths, Russia's military strategy faces significant challenges and limitations. The first challenge is economic. Sustaining a modernized military requires substantial financial resources, which are increasingly strained by economic sanctions and domestic needs. The second challenge is demographic. Russia's population is aging, and the pool of eligible military recruits is shrinking. This could limit Russia's ability to maintain a large, capable military force. The third challenge is geopolitical. Russia's aggressive actions have united Western nations and galvanized NATO. The expansion of NATO's presence in Eastern Europe and the increased military support for Ukraine are direct responses to Russian aggression. This geopolitical backlash could limit Russia's strategic options and create new security challenges. For Russia to avoid the disastrous consequences of its current trajectory, a reassessment of its military strategy and foreign policy is essential. Diplomatic engagement with the West, coupled with economic reforms, could alleviate some of the pressures facing Russia. Reducing military engagements and focusing on domestic development could strengthen Russia's long-term stability. Diplomatic engagement with the West is crucial for de-escalating tensions and avoiding further isolation. Russia could pursue confidence-building measures, arms control agreements, and dialogues on regional security issues. By engaging diplomatically, Russia could reduce the risk of military confrontations and create a more stable international environment. Economic reforms are essential for addressing the underlying causes of Russia's economic woes. Diversifying the economy, reducing reliance on energy exports, and improving the business environment could attract foreign investment and stimulate growth. These reforms would require significant political will and the willingness to tackle corruption and inefficiency within the Russian economy. 
shifting focus from external military engagements to domestic development could strengthen Russia's long-term stability. Investments in infrastructure, education, and healthcare could improve living standards and reduce domestic unrest. By addressing the needs of its populace, Russia could build a more resilient society capable of weathering economic and geopolitical challenges. President Vladimir Putin's warnings of World War III and Russia's aggressive military strategy have significant implications for both Russia and the global community. While these threats may serve short-term strategic goals, they also carry the risk of disastrous consequences for Russia. Economic collapse, military overextension, and domestic unrest are potential outcomes of continued aggression. To avoid these outcomes, Russia must reassess its military strategy and pursue diplomatic engagement, economic reforms, and domestic development. Only by addressing these challenges can Russia hope to secure a stable and prosperous future.